Hi, it is midday on Monday the 5th of August and it is time for... Day in my PJ now! <laughs> Today in my PJ. So how are you? So how are you? Oh! I'm here, sweetie. <laughs> Lum. Uh, um, how are you? All right, Bobo. He's watching Emperor's New Groove, so he doesn't want to talk to us. <laughs> I hope you're well. Um, right, let's get on with this. So, with today face cream makeup challenges, maybe this one can or less. I had chips. I did craft. I spent a lovely hour sitting in my new chair with an audio book on, knitting away last night. It was fantastic. I need to do a batch. I did not do the garden, but that's cool because it rained all night last night. <laughs> so the garden is fine. Um, I didn't do my weights because I was so tired when I went to bed. And I'd already put oil and cream on my hands by the time I sort of thought about it, and I thought it was a bit late now. I'm dropping weights on my toes if I <laughs> if I uh, pick them up. Uh, oh, so, what did I do in the way of steps? I didn't do a huge amount yesterday. Three thousand and forty-five. Oh dear, that's a bit bad after the last few days. But I think I needed that. I was going to take this week off, but um, basically, there's only like two people in my team who are actually doing the challenge this week and uh, well, there is another one but she's like moving and I don't even know why she said she'd be in really because she's not going to contribute much I know that much she's probably going to end up costing us points more than anything and I thought well I can't leave them just the two of them <laughs> so I'm gonna Join in as best I can. Right. Oh, I didn't... Oh, look, I haven't done the third either. Oh, my goody aunt. Right, what did we do on the third? Let's have a look. That was when I found my chair. So I'm going to grab the pen for the third. I can't remember if I told you, so I'm going to tell you again. I did a bit of research on that chair the night I got it it turns out that um, to buy that chair brand new it cost you about 500 quid bargain I was really chuffed about that really really chuffed so yesterday yeah, I'm gonna put resting anything else there so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to move these to do's onto my note page over here because then I can keep an eye on what gets done and what doesn't get done bit of a giggle today I've got a letter addressed to my dad okay not quite so unusual you might think that's the fact my dad's been dead 12 years so I opened it up and it's going on about a government pension scheme that he paid into, apparently, and that he never claimed back. And I was like, oh, as his um, only family, remaining family member, that means that I'm entitled to claim it. So I phoned him up and I said, oh, you know, blah, 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 blah. And she said, all right. So she put me through to the right department. And the boat's like, oh, I'm very sorry. And I explained it to him. I said, no, no, you know, I just, you know, how, how do I go about claiming it? So he said, oh, yeah, no, that's very easy. And then he was like, don't get too excited, though. He said, it's only £9.36. <laughs> and I was like, oh, OK. And he said, but he said, it has been sat there since 1986. So you might have accrued a little bit of interest. <laughs> I was like, oh, bummer. 
I had visions of paying off my loan or, you know, being able to give my mum some money or something. I was just like, oh, okay. That really sucks. <laughs> oh, dear. It would have been nice. In my day. Okay, so that is now my to-do list. And we can change the pen. I didn't draw anything yesterday. I just did a little bit of journaling and that's it. So... Oh dear. Still in pain, but I'm not going out today, I'm just stepping around the house. <sighs> Mainly because when I got up it was raining. It's now lovely, but I just don't, I don't feel up to it. I wouldn't be able to handle Daryl in running jumping mode while I'm like, oh, ouch, oh, ouch. <laughs> But yes, we've had the whole kit and caboodle today. See, it says raining there. It was raining this morning, but now it's beautiful. And it just says overcast all day. And yeah, I can see clear blue sky out there. So it's full of shit, isn't it? Let's try the Met Office and see what they say. Because I'm going to put a fucking sun in it, whether it kills me. Yeah, see, yeah, they say cloudy with a patch of sun. They also say it's 21 and 16, and they say 23 and 13. So let's meet in the middle and do 23 and 16. Sorry about the noise, my neighbour is drilling. This is my new neighbour. He did say when he first moved in, I'll be doing a few home improvements. And I honestly thought it wouldn't be today because I thought you'd be at work, but I guess not. I saw him yesterday with a paint roller, so he's obviously been hard at it, you know. 22 high and 16 low I'm going to put there. I am going to add a little bit of rain because it did rain when I woke up this morning. It was raining. So... 0536 was sun up and 844 is sunset. So you know what? I haven't even brushed my teeth and done my face yet. Just haven't bothered. I'm gonna use the green witch tower again, I just fancy it. Hopefully, there will be an evening edition tonight. I'll put a message up at the end if I'm not up for doing an evening edition. We'll just have to see. I'm getting a lot of major cards out at the moment. So, the crone is a loner. She likes to be on her own. She enjoys her own company. Um, she finds other people a bit, uh, you know, a bit stupid really I suppose. Well not stupid, just she hasn't got much tolerance for them. I know how she feels, it's probably talking about me. Um, but... It's worth noting that excuse me. <laughs> it's worth noting that um, if this is you or if if you relate to this, that you you prefer your own company. That sometimes the company of others is not necessarily a bad thing. Okay, or this might be somebody that you know that seems to enjoy their own company, but it might, especially if it's an older person. Um, it seems to enjoy their own company, but that might not necessarily be the case. It might just be worth getting in touch. Okay, just make sure they're okay. Put your own company is all well and good, but don't forget the people around you. Right, so how did we sleep? From about half twelve until about half seven, when Daryl woke me up. He came and got in my bed at some point. I think it was about four o'clock. 
but on the whole I slept quite well. I did start the night off with my electric blanket on just to help ease my back and warm my feet up. I can't go to sleep if I've got cold feet. Oh, I had cold feet when I went to bed. Um, so I put the blanket on just to get me warmed up and relaxed. But I did actually remember to turn it off last night, something I forget to do quite frequently in the winter. Thankfully it seems to have an auto cut off thing. Where, um, it turns itself off after a certain amount of time. I love electric blankets because they stay hot. Not like um, hot water bottles that sort of, you know, are brilliant when you first put them on to the point of, oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, ow, oh, you know, because um, they're so, so hot. But then after sort of about an hour, they're useless because the, the heat's dissipated so much. And I can't use a wheat pack because, A, again, I find that they cool down too quickly. And the majority of wheat packs, or just about every wheat pack out there on, I have ever found has lavender in it. I'm allergic to lavender. So. Okie okay, What are we? We're Monday today. Um, yeah, I haven't done anything. <laughs> I've checked the laundry, but I don't have any. Because I did it all yesterday. Good when that happens, isn't it? So, I'm going to go upstairs and brush my teeth, mainly, because my teeth are a bit crap nothing in for today now I did do a couple of things yesterday I have just spoken to my mother about the rent so I don't need to move that one forward and the right to Wendy I've brought forward but I need to double check with her when she wants to do it she did text me this morning and say that she wasn't ready to send yet so I said that's fine because I haven't done that either. Um, yeah, so this weekend. So I need to get writing to her at some point. And I'm going to go into town at some point as well to... Um, go to the bank and get some more of those postcards so that I could send a load off but I've got to go to Sandown tomorrow because I just got a groomer's appointment and I can go and see Stuart's mum so that'll be good so I've got to do's there <sighs> so yeah that's pretty much it really um, gosh I can't believe it's the 5th of August already April left me a comment. I forgot to label the third day Sunday. Yeah, no, I'm not putting in the days. If that's what you mean. April put, Sam, you forgot to number the third day Sunday. April, it was a totally overcast day, no sun. Well, she put, Sam, you forgot to number the third day sun. I'm a bit lost about what you meant, April. Are you talking about the weather? Because Mary's put, it was a totally overcast day, no sun. That was both Saturday and Sunday. It was totally overcast and there was no sun. And I didn't number it. I put 30, 21 and 14 up there. Is that what you were talking I'm, I'm a bit confused. If you leave me a comment, let me know what you meant. Or did you mean, did I miss it in my weeks or something? I'm not 100% sure what, I'm, what, what, what you were referring to, sweetie. If you could let me know, I'd appreciate it. Right. I'm going to leave that there because I need to get up and move. I'm pretty sure I might have just slightly slipped a disc. Cause it's a familiar pain. I felt that pain before and that's exactly what it feels like and it hurts and it feels quite disgusting so yeah right I will see you all later have a good rest of your day and you will either get now the evening edition or 
me coming back going, yeah, not going to happen, guys. See you tomorrow. All right? I don't know which it will be yet. Good evening. There's mess everywhere. I've been creating. It's Wendy's fault, of course. It's always Wendy's fault. There's paper and bits and stuff everywhere. And I can't show you what I've made because I'm going to send it to Wendy. And I'm so excited. And I made two and I can't even show you the other one because it's exactly the same. And I don't want Wendy to see it. I can give you a sneaky peek. There you go. Look, 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 look. Ooh. But that's it. That's all, that's all you get. <laughs> okay. So we did weather. What did we do today? <laughs> oh dear. I have put on my day face cream. Uh, I haven't done the challenge yet. I've not had booze. Okay, that's all I can fill in so far because I may craft in a little while. Right, I am gonna. The pain is quite bad again because I've been stepping. I didn't take the week off. And I am gonna. Because me and my sewing machine got on really well. I'm going to draw a happy, happy face. Even though the first one I mucked up and that's why I made two. But that's okay. That's all part of the experience. And as soon as I'd done it, I went, oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> like you do. I filled in that this morning. Oh, I didn't write that in. Uh, black pen. I am all over the place. I've got messages coming in galore and I'm not even looking at them. <laughs> I sent Wendy a message going, I did it! I sewed! <laughs> She's sitting there fucking wetting herself at me. Uh, what am I looking for? Steps. Oh dear. Right. 3,045 was 1.26 miles and I had to write it partially outside the box because um, yeah tiny writing I am however up to 1,916 miles uh, steps so yeah not doing too bad at all I want to say something else now what can I say oh yeah Guess what my word is going to be? What can I say now? I just want to try that, G. Hmm. Right. It's not one I would normally use, you see. But sometimes it looks quite ornate. Yeah, whatever. Okay. Uh, right. All the beds in the house have now been washed <laughs> because Alex stripped his bed this morning and then I chucked Darren in the bath and I stripped his bed. Um, I haven't done anything else, so I need to do all that, which I'll go and do in a minute before I get ready for bed. So yeah, that was... Uh... Okay, the week is starting to fill up. Um, I need to go and buy a fridge magnet for Jo Lynn's daughter because Jo Lynn's sending me some goodies and I said look I need to send you something back and she said well my daughter wants a fridge magnet she collects them and apparently her daughter doesn't or her daughter's friends or something don't believe that Jo Lynn has friends over here so I said I would find her an Isle of Wight magnet and then I sent her a photo to show her daughter of all my magnets on my fridge and um, apparently her daughter went oh, well <laughs> because <laughs> I have a few and I've been collecting them for 20 odd years actually I need some more magnets so this is my to-do list uh, yeah I haven't made any any advances on any of that right so we've got as far as drawing five didn't we 
so today's word is going to be logical. Ooh. That's not right, is it? It's logical, not logical. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Give up with that one. <laughs> oh, my God. You'd think I'd know how to fucking spell logical by now. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, there you go. I'm, le I'm, I'm leaving it there. I'm going to bed now. Because it's just, it's just ridiculous. Ridiculous. Because I'm a tit. It's because I'm tired. That's what that is. Right. I can't even tell you why I... Probably because uh, I used that for the CEO mode and I just kept going. <sighs> oh well, never mind. Thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. You can even call me an idiot. I'd, <laughs> I'd probably agree with you right now. Um, click the book and you'll be subscribed. And if you hit the bell that appears, hopefully you'll be notified when I upload new content if YouTube's in a good mood. Take it easy, guys, and I will see you in Tuesday's edition of Today in My Boot. Bye.